Knowing how to use one of these can help keep air from leaking in and out of your home and save you money every month. I'm Carrie with EPB and today we'll find out how. Air leaking in and out of your home can really kill your energy efficiency and drive your energy bills up. But if you know how to take care of it, you can make your home more comfortable and cost effective. So let's get some tips from EPB Energy Pro, Wayne Cagle. Hi, Wayne. Hi, Carrie. Okay, so let's start with, I don't even know if I have leaks. How do I determine if I have any leaks in my house and what am I looking for? Okay, so when you go into a room and it's warmer than another room, then you might want to go around your windows and feel and see if you feel air or around a door and see or around your ducts just to see if you're feeling where this air or heat's coming from. And if you can't find that, mm -hmm. you can call EPB and we will come out and we will do a uh, infrared camera around in these rooms and see if we can find where these air leaks are. And actually we can offer that as part of EPB's home energy checkup that we do for free, right? Yes, we will. That's great. Okay, so now let's say I find a leak. What do I do to fix it? You need to either use caulk or weather stripping. Okay. It's according to what you're doing. Windows would be good for caulking. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then on the um, attic hatches and doors, the weather stripping. Okay. And oh, cool! You have some right here. I sure do. And uh, this is the least expensive. Okay, and I like that. That's that's good. Yes, <laughs> We're also very good. good. Least expensive. And always. it seems like it's easy to use too. Yes, it's called the peel and stick. Yeah. And what it is is, if you notice, it's sticky on one side, and you peel when you peel this off, and you just stick it to it, run it down so your door, simple. and just cut it off to your length. Yeah. Make sure you know you look at your door and you see what your door is requiring. Yeah, this is like an inch wide. Right. So if you've only got a quarter inch, then you want to buy a quarter inch size that you can just peel and stick. See, kids, math is important, right? Math is <laughs> always important. Okay, that seems super easy, and I love that you said it's it's not expensive. And then on the caulking, uh, caulking is going to depend on what kind you use mm -hmm. is by what you're selling to what. Okay. If you're using masonry to wood, then you're going to use a different caulking than if you're doing wood to wood. Mm -hmm. This is a silicone caulking, and this silicone is better on the outside or anything around water. Okay. Uh, because it, it's going to be more water, it's water resistant. So just know your type, find the right type. Yes, and, and you, a lot of your call will show what it's for. Now, as we're talking about leaks, it's important to talk about attic entry points, right? Because those can get overlooked. Oh, yes. Yes, when you've got hot days up in the summer and you've got that 100 degree heat up there and you can you can go up there and feel air heat right. coming down. If you weather strip around there, that's going to stop the air flow coming out of that attic down to it. Which is going to, in the long run, save you money. It's going to save you money. It's going to make your, it's not going to make that air conditioner cut on his off. That's great. Now, there are two tests that EPB provides, blower door and duct blaster test that I want to tell everybody about. Can you tell us what those do? Yes, the blower door test is testing how much air leakage is in the house per hour. So we'll set up a, a fake door with a big fan in it and it pressurizes the house so we can see how many air changes there are per hour. Wow. And the higher the air changes, the more air leakage you've got. Okay. Okay. And then the duct blaster does the same thing for the ducts. Okay. And you'll find out how much leakage you've got in your ducts where you can go and seal your duct work up. That's great. And these tests, of course, are helping us save money. And if I want these tests done, what do I do? You just call EPB and tell them you want a blower door and duct blaster test, and we'll send one of us out and we'll do it for you. Fantastic. Yeah, Thanks, great. Wayne. That is great info. Now I'm going to show you one more way that air can get in and out that you might not have thought about. These things right here. That's right, light switches and outlets on exterior walls in your home can sometimes let air in and out. Luckily, there's an easy fix. This is called an outlet gasket, and you can pick them up from any local hardware store. To install these, you just remove the outlet cover, add the gasket to keep the air from getting through, and put the cover back on. It's as easy as that. And now you know. These are just a few of the things you can do to make your home more energy efficient. But if you have questions or need help, you can always call an EPB Energy Pro or submit a request at epb.com slash energy pros. You can even schedule a home energy checkup absolutely free. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.